hey y'all welcome back to my channel or welcome for the first time if this is your first fifth 37 56 time welcome baby we are over here on the couch by the africa portrait you could just see like south africa right there <laughs> um but we are going to do a very exciting video today i am going to do a little bit of a reveal into a, a another piece of me which is perfume I love fragrances. You may or may not know that if you may have watched some of my videos in the past. First of all, shout out to Dossier for sponsoring this video. I'm super duper excited. So I'm going to kind of, you know, let you in on a little bit of my collection today. I'm going to break this up into a few parts, but I'm going to start with my pretty much my favorites and my go to's the most. Um, also, because Dossier is sponsoring this video, I just wanted to uh, put my coupon code at the beginning of the video just in case you don't. I don't want you to miss it at the end. So if you plan on getting any of the Dossier perfumes that I talk about, you can get a little bit of money off. So my code is Nikki10, that's N-I-C-I-1-0 for 10% off. Save you a little bit of money. Who doesn't love to save money? I love to save money. <laughs> So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and go off into this collection and then we're going to talk a little bit later. Okay. 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 So pretty much for my collection, I'm going to start off with the most affordable ones, which are going to be my dossier scents. So first I want to talk about Oriental Tobacco and Oriental, it, it looks like this. Oriental Tobacco is Dossier's version of Tom Ford's Tobacco Vanille. And if you've never smelled this before, it smells like a jazz club kind of. It gives you like replica jazz club, but like very much more like put together, if that makes any sense. So I feel like this is more, I'm going to go ahead and spray it on the box because I already have my scent on for today. But I feel like it's more of a masculine scent a woman can definitely get away with this but i'm just here for this if you've ever smelled um tobacco vanille then you know it is a very thick smell so this is this is a thick scent um but i love it though like it's it's one of those ones like if you smell somebody with it you're going to remember it okay like it's it's a very memorable scent and what i love most about dossiers perfumes and colognes and fragrances is the cost okay so i have my little notes down here so tom ford's tobacco vanille it goes anywhere from 163 for their smaller bottle to 360 to the larger bottle and when i say larger it's it's not that big so the fact that you can get oriental tobacco 50 milliliter 1.7 ounce for 39 dollars like you cannot beat that like you literally can't and I mean, so if you have a guy in your life that you want to get a gift for, or if you're like me, I know I've said this in previous videos, but I'm going to say it again, just in case this is your first video. I like to buy colognes to spray around my house, whether it's on my sheets, whether it's on my robe or something like that. I like the smell of a man. And since I ain't got one, I just go ahead <laughs> and just, you know, pretend he's here. I'm just going to manifest him via scent, you know? Um, but yeah, so I go ahead and I get some colognes because... I like the way they smell. I like to have them around. That kind of thing. So, I mean, if you're like me, I don't know if that makes me sad. I don't know if it sounds bad. I honestly don't care. It's me. It's just something that I enjoy. But, yeah. So, I, you know, if you want to be one of those type of people, go ahead and do it. Uh, again, Dossier, they have their own iconic signature scents that are, you know, very similar to these high-end perfumes. But you're going to get it at the fraction of a cost. So, who doesn't want to do that? My next scent, I actually do have the high-end version. And then I also have the Dossier version, which is super exciting because we can compare the two. So this is YSL uh, Mon Paris, and this is Floriental Brown Sugar. So this is supposed to be Dossier's version of this scent. And we're just gonna go ahead and check out the difference. I'm gonna spray these on the cards because again, I already have my scent on for the day. So this is like a very like fresh, floral, fruity 
type of scent. I really, really, really do like this scent. And let's see if Oriental Brown Sugar. So I want to see, I want to show you how the Automizer is. Very nice. Oh shoot, I can smell the difference. <laughs> okay, I'm here for it. So the notes of this is bergamot, raspberry, pear. Uh, that's the top notes. Middle notes, jasmine, orange blossom, and brown sugar. Jasmine and orange blossom are two of my favorites, uh, along with the neroli. And this also has a base note of patchouli, amber, and vanilla. And you can definitely tell, like, you can smell, like, the fruitiness. That's where the raspberry and the pear come into play. But I love, love, love this. This is like a signature scent. So you can wear this anywhere any occasion there it's not like you can you know some scents are more like nighttime like even the uh oriental tobacco i feel like it's more of a night scent even for a man like if he's going out somewhere it's not necessarily one that you would just lounge around the house in that's i don't really think you would wear that one to work because it is very thick and very heavy whereas this is very very light and i'm here for this so ysl mom Paris, this one here, let me put the cap on because I will lose it. It retails for $76. That's the cheapest that I could find it. And Florianto Brown Sugar is $29 on Dossier's website. So definitely check this out. Definitely check this out as well. You don't you you don't want to miss these. I promise you. I promise you. Okay, so now we're gonna get into some of my absolute favorites so i don't know where to begin um so a 12 volant from louis vuitton is probably my favorite fragrance period like ever and i don't know if it's because it just reminds me of like a really good memory or like when i purchased it it was just like a really good experience but i got a whole bunch of samples at Louis Vuitton and um, the moment I smelled it, I was just like, yep, this is it. <laughs> this the one, we, we don't have to, we don't have to go nowhere. We don't have to go no farther. Like literally I took the tester, I tried to test her out. I wore it a lot of places and I love the compliment of you smell good. So regardless of what I'm wearing, how much I'm wearing, wherever I go, I honestly do get the you smell good compliment. And that's like one of my top tier compliments that I'd be going for personally. I don't know about you, but that's what I go for. Um, when I heard that like Priyanka Chopra and uh, Rihanna, wherever they go, whenever they get interviewed, the people automatically say that they smell good. I'm like, I want to be that person. So when y'all meet me, I promise you I'm going to smell good because it's it, I take it serious. OK, uh, also in the pandemic last year in 2020, I set out to build up my collection so I would try to buy a, par a perfume once a week even if it was like a little travel size like I wanted to build up my collection and so I set out to do it and that's what I've done thanks to y'all for you know not skipping the ads and things so appreciate y'all but a 12 Falant, it is um it's just beautiful I don't know how else to explain it if you can go get a sample uh get a sample i'm telling you if dossier ever comes out with their version of this i'm going to buy 25 of them just because i don't want to keep using this up but i love this so much it is so bomb one of the top notes in this is osmanthus which is a flower i think it's it, don't get, don't quote me but i believe it's a japanese flower but this is kind of like a champagne -y floral Lee. it's very light it gives you summer it gives you date night it gives you like this girl has it together and that's how i feel every single time i wear it i believe this has neroli in it as well like i told you orange blossom neroli those are like some of my favorite top notes and this right here beast mode as far as project projection um definitely does linger on the skin it lasts pretty long like i i love 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 this and i get so many compliments definitely check this out you know, I just mentioned Rihanna smelling good all the time and it was rumored that she wears this next scent which is love don't be shy by Killian and this is one of my 
Uh, this is one of my favorites as well. You just smell like a sexy cupcake. That's the best way that I can describe this. It's very gourmand. My, my fragrance palette is very gourmandy right now. I don't know why. If you don't know what gourmand is, it's like scents that mimic fruits and, or not fruits, but foods. Um, so pretty much anything like this. Some people have said that it smells like Fruit Loops. Some people have said that it smells like a cupcake, but I just love it. It's like a marshmallowy, like a sexy marshmallow cupcake vibe. It does have orange blossom in it as well. And I'm just here for this. Like I got the travel set yet, yet again. First I got some samples, then I got the travel size. And then I finally just went ahead and got this for myself. As you can see, there is a, a pretty big dent in this bottle. I try not to wear it that much because it is a, it is, it's very, very expensive. But I think it is very much so worth it. Again, this is another one. It lasts really well on the skin. On the skin, it lasts really well on your clothes. I'm a clothes sprayer. I'm a skin sprayer. I'm an over sprayer. Over sprayers unite in the comments because I know I'm not the only one. <laughs> I know there's plenty of us, but I absolutely love this scent. If I ever went on dates, you know, when I go on dates in the future, I will be wearing this because uh, she she's bae. Like the bottle is so pretty. I don't know if you can see the detail but has like gold on it you know i'm a golden girl has like this cute little design on the side i i'm i'm just here for this and yeah i i love it I love my it. next favorite is kind of also a dossier as well so um this is ambery saffron can you see the dent that i have in this so ambery saffron is Dossier's version of Baccarat Rouge 540. And I wear these together, actually. So they smell pretty much identical. Like, if you, to the untrained nose, to somebody who doesn't really know their fragrances, you could get away with just wearing this. Um, I, like I said, it literally spells, smells the same. So if anything, like, I wear the, I, I don't know why I wear the two of them together. I'm going to be honest. I don't have a reason. <laughs> I just, like I said, I'm an over sprayer. So I usually would spray the most with this and just hit Baccarat Rouge like two times behind my ears or something like that. I also have the fragrance oil for Baccarat Rouge 540. But this is another one that first I got the fragrance oil and I would wear that out like a, like a perfume. Then when I got my uh, partnership with dossier i went ahead and got that as one of my um perfumes to try and i fell in love with the scent so then eventually i just went ahead and bought this as well i will i will go ahead and say you can save your money and don't buy this get the dossier version and then use nikki tan and get 10 percent off of it i believe dossier's version is 49 dollars for this this is more than $49 a lot more than $49 so save your money because I guarantee you I, I would even go as far as to say when I have worn ambery saffron by itself I actually get more compliments on this than when I wear Baccarat Rouge 540 so I don't know what that means but I don't know if that means that this one projects more or that people just happen to notice it more but I definitely do get more compliments on ambery saffron than I do on Baccarat Rouge 540. I don't know why, but I'm just saying. That's it. <laughs> Next up, we have a newbie to the group, but she has quickly worked her way up into being a favorite, which kind of has thrown me for a loop because she just came out and it's the K.I. Kali Lee Invite Only Amber 23. And that's actually my scent of the day, so I can go ahead and spray her on because I'm already wearing her. This, y'all... She smells amazing. <laughs> like it's absolutely amazing. Like I love it. Um, and she retails for about a hundred dollars ish somewhere around there, but it's this, this is going to be an amazing scent for date night. This is going to be, uh, and when I say going to be, because it's more of a fall scent, but I 
for some reason I've fallen in love with her right now. She dries down on me to like an oud slash honey combo. So some people say they get more cherry. Some people say they get more of a chocolate. On me personally, she dries down to like a honey oud combo. But I've heard that if you combine her with Tom Ford's Lost Cherry or any scent that has like a cherry kind of mood to it, that it will last a little bit longer. But I honestly just love, love, love this. She just came out. She's brand new. I'm here for it. I've it, Literally, I just got this. And you see this 10 milliliter is pretty much gone. So I went ahead and ordered the uh, 100 milliliter because I'm not about to play these games with myself. It's very much so like a fall winter scent. Like I said, I've been obsessed with her, but she just gives me like, it's very, very sexy. It's very, very like pretty. And, um, I've heard that it's called invite only because it's more of a skin scent. So if you don't spray it on your clothes, it's going to be something that like not many people will smell unless they are close to you, like invite only, which I think is a pretty cool feature. Um, but I spray my clothes. So I want everybody to know I got some on if I got it on. So <laughs> I'll be inviting everybody to smell me. But I love, love, love this. It's kind of like a cherry Coca-Cola meets Oud. Um, it's so bomb. It's so, so, so bomb. Yeah. Okay, also, one of my other favorites. I'm actually completely out of her right now. Like, there might be an inch of a spray left in here. Oh, she's just so pretty. I have to, I have to re-get this. But this is Cartier... La Panther or Cartier Panther, whichever you prefer. Um, and I actually came across this because I watched Aaliyah face, Aaliyah's face, sis video braces y'all. Um, and she recommended it and I found it at, I want to say Nordstrom maybe. And I went ahead and copped it. And as you can see, it's, it's gone. So I love this. I will definitely be repurchasing soon. I ended up wearing this to bed every night. Granted, I go to bed by myself every night, but I just love the scent. It's hard to explain. Like, I don't know notes or anything like that, but it basically just smells like somebody who has their stuff together. Okay. And as somebody who wants to have their stuff together, I enjoy it. So <laughs> I just love this. It's very mature. Um, I will say that like my whenever I would wear it I got I got a lot of compliments on it when I wore it out and my mom fell in love with it so I got it for her for Mother's Day so it is something that you know anybody from any age can wear and you know still smell good it all depends on your body chemistry but I I mean it smells just as good on my mom as it does on me but yeah so I gotta re-up but I do definitely love 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 this this is again another like date night situation if you just going out and about girls night girls brunch whatever take this spray it on out the door you won't be mad so also from killian we have princess and princess is very much so along the same lines as love don't be shy but they're like cousins it's like how when we found out that gabrielle union and uh, sawate or sweetie were cousins that's how it was like that's how these are these are like cousins that are both bomb but like bomb in their own perspective ways you know like their their own separate ways so i feel like love don't be shy is like the gabrielle union and then princess is like sweetie like it's younger it's more hip but you know love don't be shy like i said she's just bomb like you know bomb all the way around you know you want to be just like her that kind of thing and but princess holds her own again it's kind of a marshmallowy scent yet again like i said I, i'm in a, a gourmandy season of my life um and i have been for maybe about the last six months but previously i was never into those type of scents i was more of like a a rose girl but I've graduated like my my scent palette has graduated but I am just here 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 for her I love princess so so much I think this is the bigger bottle I think I got the big bottle because I didn't want to run out because I heard they were discontinuing 
I've sprayed so many scents today. I heard that they were discontinuing, but I'm not too sure. But definitely, definitely, definitely love, love Princess. If you hear a noise, it's the dog upstairs. Um, it's playing catch with itself, or maybe it's on her. I just wish they would stop, especially while I'm trying to film. But anyway, that concludes part one of my fragrance collection. Um, again, please check out Dossier. All their information will be linked below. They are all the information, all of their information will be linked below as well as my coupon code, as well as the scents that I talked about. I will link those as well. And again, everything on their site is at a fraction of the cost of these high end perfumes and scents and fragrances that you can get for way, 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 way cheaper. Um, also, if you buy, I believe, more than two, you will get some bundle deal as well. And you can still use my coupon code for that as well. So, I mean, it's literally like a win-win situation. I think they've gone away with the testing. Uh, they used to send a little tester bottle for you to test out before you um, use the big bottle. And then you could send the big bottle back risk-free. I'm not sure exactly about that. But if they still do it that way, then it's completely risk-free. And again, you can get some really, really, really dope fragrances and dope scents for literally a third of what their uh, high-end counterparts are. So uh, definitely check them out. Uh, comment below if you want part two of the fragrance uh, collection because I have a whole lot more where this came from. Trust me when I tell you there is so much more if you want me to do a video as far as like scents for different occasions comment below and let me know i ain't gonna do nothing until you tell me what you want so you gotta tell me what you want which really we want just tell me what you want which really really want <laughs> again check out dossier all the information will be below use my coupon code check out these fragrances i want us all looking good and smelling good i will see y'all first of all in the comments and then second of all in the next video See you next time.